Hello, very welcome back once again in our series on industry electronics. Today, in this module, we will explain and demonstrate how to test a push button switch. As you can see on your screen, you have a breadboard and on that I have placed a one simple small push button switch that is commonly used to on and off purpose. For on and off purpose in electronics, this push button switch is commonly used. Now our job here or task here is to test and to know if we use this switch in the circuit whether it is functional or not. So let us see how this switch looks like. So you can see now in uh, my hand I have this switch and it has got four pins basically. So you can see that four metal pins and then there is this button here which you can actually push right so it's just pushed and released so it comes up after pushing so we want to know when it is not pushed which of these pins are connected to each other and when it is pushed which of these pins make connection to each other so that's how we will know how the switch will work and how we can actually use it so i have put it put this switch in this fashion so two switches are this side and the two legs are this side and two legs are on the right side so after putting that one two two legs metal legs are this side two metal legs are this side so i am going to use a multimeter now so you can see now i have this multimeter and i have set the knob of this multimeter to this continuity test let me show you in the you can see that red probe is connected here black probe is connected here and the red probe you see the sign is milliamp volt ohm and there is this buzzer sign that is the continuity test that is for the continuity and here the knob is selected at the continuity there is a diode symbol and the buzzer symbol so that's how and now I have these two leads if I connect them together it should be the sound let me do that again okay I have to turn it on again and now do it okay there is no sound here so I have to let's say switch it off first again and now maybe let's say I put it in the continuity test you now can see there is a clear beep and there is also LED on the multimeter lighting up again okay so now when I do that uh, I am now going to test my switch both in off state and the on state so first let's see what connections are there so what i'll do i'll put two wires here there is no beep coming out of the multimeter so these two pins are not connected to each other similarly right over here i will see there is no beep so these two pins are not connected here however what about i put these two leads here you now see these two leads are connected to each other and there is a beep and the light similarly these two leads are connected to each other and there is a sound and the light what if i press this button now on the top and then make the make the connection so for example i want to see that these two are not connected to each other but now after pressing this 
I press this button and there is a sound and the light. Similarly, I make the connection here and press the button. Let me do that very well. You can see now there is a sound and all that. So this is how after pressing this button, I am making these two pins connect to each other and these two pins connect to each other. Okay. So what if so that's how I do it right and uh, when it is in the off state these two pins are not connected to each other. So what if I press the button you see now if I press the button these two are connected to each other similarly if I press these two and press the button again there is this one how about these two this is already connected but what if I press the button this is already connected and if I press the button it doesn't make any difference so this is how you actually can test the switch I hope you found this module useful you understood how the switch works and how we can actually test it it's very simple you know that these two pins and these two pins again once again let us see they are not connected to each other but when you press you have a connection similarly these two are not connected to each other but when you press these two will make the connection okay so this is how it works so hope you found this model useful you understood how the switch works if you found this model useful share it with others for wider reach and stay tuned for more engaging content like this till then wish you happy learning this is the taste of short circuit and the open circuit okay